Hi everybody, um, this is a grocery haul from a local store in my area, it's called Costless. And they have great ads once a week. They offer some great items uh, to draw you into their store. And um, I try to save up money so I can get their main sales every week. So here is the QR code in case you need that. Okay, so what I did is um, I got, the first thing I got were two Pepsis. They are $8.98, limit of two. So I got two zero sugars. I love zero sugar Pepsi and um, cannot be without it. So I grabbed two of those, $8.98. And right here, they were regular, um, manager savings $3 off. So they were regular $11.98. And then they took off, um, I guess $4, I don't know. And um, and then, but we are charged $1.20 per case for CRV tax. It's a California redemption tax. So um, I paid $8.98 plus $1.20 on each pack. Okay, so then I also got the mail. They had the mail for $3.98. And I only got one because I only had so much money to spend. And um, this is a good size. This is 30 ounce. So this is a big bottle. And it was only $3.98, so I got one. They have a limit of two. And then this was a great deal. They have the Lay's Hickory Barbecue Chips. And these are only $1.98. They have a limit of two, and I only bought one. And um, the Wavy Barbecue are my favorite that Lay's has. So um, I probably should have bought two, but I just got the one. Okay, so then... Um, I also grabbed the potatoes. I like getting their, the potatoes from there. Now this is a 10 pound bag, as you can see, and they have the best price of potatoes. So it's a $1.78 for a 10 pound bag, but limit of one. Normally when they go on sale, they don't put limits, but um, this time they did. Normally um, they go on, they even go down on sale to $1.58 and they've never had a limit. So I was surprised to see that. But I'm thinking maybe because Thanksgiving is coming and um, people probably would have wiped them out before then if they didn't put that limit, I guess. Okay, so the next thing I saw in the ad was three for 99 cent vegetables. So what I did is um, I like corn. And so I got three corn and three green beans. And um, people always want to know the expression date. Let's see. This is Best Buy December 2026, so for another good year. And uh, this is same, December 2026. People always think that just because it's on sale, it must be old, but it's not. So I want to show you that. So I paid a uh, dollar for three and a dollar for three, so two bucks for six cans, which was so awesome. So right here you can see my soda sale, my wavy lays, dollar off, my green beans, and the corn. So uh, they, they had to keep taking money off. I don't know why that looks like that. Okay. So then, um, oh, I also got some olives. I almost forgot. I put those up there. Okay, so I got more olives. And uh, how much did I pay for that? $1.58. And the reason why I got these, because next week I do want to make, um, for Thanksgiving, some macaroni salad. I like to put olives in my macaroni salad. And that's why I needed the bigger mayo, because I just had the little ones, and I know when I make my macaroni salad, I'm going to go through this. I probably should have got two now that I think about it. Okay, so what else was in their ad? Um, they had some pies on sale. I didn't get any pies. Um, I'm going to make a peach cobbler for Thanksgiving, so I didn't get any of that. I'm not an ice cream eater. I like milkshakes, um, but I'm not big on, on just eating ice cream from a bowl. I'm not into that. Okay, so they also had the, the coffee folders on sale, and I thought about getting it, but I thought, well, I'm on a limited budget. Okay, so the other things I ended up getting that were not on the sale ad is I got a loaf of bread, and I know I just made some bread right here but um and i have a little bit of sourdough left this is my, my little bread area so um i had just made some a loaf of bread my own homemade with flour and that was some cornbread and then this is from the store 
sourdough bread. I love my breads. So anyways, I just got this for um, the sandwich bread for sandwiches. Because I like to eat a sandwich, soup and sandwich or whatever, when I don't feel like cooking a meal. So the bread was $1.58. That was a good price. That was like an in-store special. The bread over here normally is very expensive. It's like $5 a loaf. Five, five ninety nine. Okay, and so then I also got their flour tortillas. And I guess they make them there because it, I mean, it has their name on it. I know they make their French bread there, which I absolutely love. They make the best French bread. They make rotisserie chicken there. They make um, like some pork meat you can buy there. Everything's made there. So I'm assuming they probably make these there too. These are really good. And these taste so fresh. So I like to get those. Okay, so I'm going to move that right there. And then, um, okay, so what I'm going to show you is when you buy $25, you can get a turkey. They have a limit of one. Uh, you can own 10 to 24 pounds. You get it for 38 cents a pound. Now, um, there's a man that had made a comment. Uh, his name's Billy. And he had said it, he went to grocery outlet and got the turkey for $3.99. And I thought, you know, and I'd been thinking about that. And I thought, you know what? That is a lot of meat that he got for $3.99. And so I thought, you know what? Because I just don't have any room in my freezer. So I thought, I'm going to go get a turkey. That is a smart idea. So I had to pay $0.39 cents a pound. And this is, um, how big is this? This is 11 pound turkey, so it's small. And um, I paid 38 cents a pound, so how much did it come out to? Uh, let's see, right here, turkey, 428 for this big turkey. So what my idea was is I don't, my oven doesn't work and I only have a toaster oven and there's no way this is gonna fit my toaster oven. So what I'm gonna do is because I really wanted to make a turkey for Thanksgiving, and I thought, I can't because I don't have an oven. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to saw this out and chop it up. So I'm like, I'm going to chop off the drumsticks. I'm going to chop off the breast part. Um, I'm just going to chop it all up into smaller pieces. This way it fits in my toaster oven. And I'll just cook a couple pieces at a time. Now, I might have to start a day early. I don't know because as I'm not cooking the whole turkey, I'm just cooking pieces. So we'll see how that goes. So I'll do a video when I chop it up and then I'll do a video when I cook it up. So, um, because, you know, I was thinking about his comment that he had only paid $3.99 for his turkey. He did better. I paid $4.28. Well, I paid about 29 cents more. But, you know, I, I, I kept thinking about that. I thought that is a lot of meat for the price. I gotta get it. So I'm going to chop it up so it fits in my freezer. And then when I cook it up, I'm going to cook it up chopped in a couple pieces in my toaster oven. Okay, so then the last thing I got, this is kind of like a bonus surprise. Um, so what happened is I have um, outside, I noticed, at the apartment. Well, I'll, let me just show you what I got. So the last thing I got, this was the most expensive thing. And it is a big bag of kit and caboodle uh, cat food. And this is huge. This is 15 pounds, I think. Right here. No, 13 pounds. Okay, and I paid. Now, the reason why I got this is because there is this cat that is so skinny walking around the apartment and i mean she is so skinny and um i had been putting some hot dogs out there for her well she came the other day with three kittens and i was like oh, she is so skinny and she is feeding three kittens and so she brought her kittens so i could feed them because they're a little bit bigger now and they're still small like the mom is say the mom is like this long but she's longer the mom's probably like this long and her babies are real cute they're like they're like running around like that and so i felt so bad for them so i thought i had been giving them hot dogs i've been feeding those kittens everyday hot dogs and any scraps i had so i thought i got to get them some cat food so today uh because we have that um storm coming on saturday and sunday right now it's friday and it's 
there's a lot of clouds in the sky but it is nice and warm out there right now very warm so what i'm going to do today is friday i'm going to feed them really good and um, i'm also going to have this cat food out there and i'm going to try and get an area that um this won't get wet i mean i'm keeping the whole bag in the apartment but I, I want to keep some out there for them. So I know they're probably going to go run and hide on Saturday and Sunday. So today I wanted to feed them good. So I got this for them. And I'm just going to um, pour this out every day. I felt that this is going to be better than feeding them hot dogs. Because this has all the vitamins that they need. So this was the most priciest thing I got today. And um, hold on. This is all... And how much did I pay for this? The kit and caboodle was $15.48. But I had to get it because of those kittens. I could not let them starve or die out there. There's no way. They are so precious. And um, they are even the babies are skinny. And you just feel so sorry for them. They look so helpless. So um, now they are feral. And the mother, she was out there and... Um, I was going to take her out some food, and she, I had never heard her hiss before. Normally, she so run, but I think because she had her kittens with her. So I was out there, and I was taking some food, and all of a sudden, as I'm going out there, I hear this loud, loud hissing, and I thought, oh, my gosh, it's a snake. It's a snake because of the hissing. I thought it was, I thought there was a snake hissing at me. So I was starting to panic, and I was starting to run back to the apartment, and then I thought, it can't be a snake. And so I thought, so then I realized, so then I turned back around and then um, it was her. She was hissing again. I was like, oh my gosh, I almost, you know, took off running. Because there is two things I'm scared of. No, three things. I do not like thunder and lightning. That's one. I count that as one. I don't like thunder and lightning. I scream at spiders and I scream at snakes. Like those three things. Lightning and thunder, snakes and spiders. So uh, when I heard I had seen, I was screaming. Okay, so anyways, I just want to show you what I got at the local grocery store. And they have awesome deals, awesome prices on their ads that you just cannot, you just cannot um, pass them up. So um, I paid fifty nine sixty eight, so almost 60 bucks. And I'm going to stand back so you can see what I got. So this is what I got my local grocery store, $60. Okay, everybody, thank you for watching.